Hi students, I wanted to make another quick video for you to practice your bass. This time I'm going to be focusing on the three songs that we currently know how to play, but using the bow. So as if you watch my other bowing mechanics video, you'll learn how to hold the bow as well as go over some of the stuff that we've got in class. So remember we make our fingers into a llama, we have a llama, and we look for the balance point of the bow. So try to find it. That's too far the other way. Okay, I'm almost there. All right, so with the balance point of the bow, we want to find that, and then our llama wants to bite right here where the teeth are. You can see there's a little pad between these two lines on my fingers, and you want the bow to go on those pads. That's where the teeth is of your llama when it bites the bow. So you're going to have the llama bite the bow at the balance point, then you're going to hang your pinky over, hang your first finger over, and bend your thumb. It's super important. As you can see, my thumb is nice and bent, and it's something that I'm going to keep up on you in your lessons whenever I see you, making sure that you have a curved thumb and nice curved fingers that are close together like this. All right, so our first song that we know how to do is hot cross buns. So I'm going to practice hot cross buns with the bow with you. Ready? Get your sheet out if you need it, and uh, we'll go right from the right from the top. One, two, and go. Four, one, open. Four, one, open. Open, 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 open. One, 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 four, one, open, two, three, four. Very good. Okay. Now let's play our open string scales. Ready? I'm going to start on the A string and I'm going to go open one four, then over to the D string. Open one four. Open one four, then open one four. So um, you could practice that on any string. I chose to do these ones just for this video. And then last but not least, twinkle, twinkle, little star. So, ready? We'll get our bows up, and if you want to play along, one, two, and go. Very nice. And good job with the bow. Remember, and to double check yourself, that you're moving from your elbow, leading from your elbow, and your shoulder just follows behind. We're not bowing like this, but rather like this with our elbow, just to remind you of that. Good luck, and I look forward to seeing you in your next lesson.